it going fellas gals guys and pals today we're going to be playing some lethality darius i love this build it goes hail of blades cheap shot eyeball collection ingenious hunter conditioning and overgrowth i'm playing it in the top lane against a yasuo i am super excited for this matchup one thing i really like about this build is it makes your level one cheese super super strong because you stack your autos so fast for your bleed early which is super huge for darius because that level one solely relies on his bleed now the only downfall is that us not having conk makes our team fighting a little wonky to say the least and we're gonna wait for him to step up a little more here we go and we're gonna just walk it out if he wants to stay there that's fine i'll zone him off the first three minions of his xp i should get the xp and he won't from there right Zoning him off is a super good strategy. I may not have gotten the minion gold, but he doesn't get the XP. And that's huge, which means he's not going to level up. But guess who is? Me. With overwhelming force. Super good strategy. I'm going to trade him here. He'll bleed more. My Hail of Blades is down, but I hit level 2. Guess what he's at? Level 1. Super huge. I'm hoping to get some sick W1 shots, maybe? We're, we'll see. But the crit Darius does make you pretty squishy, which is the only actual real downside of it, is the fact that you unironically are, are a, like a, a rubber bubble. Or not a rubber bubble, uh, like a just a bubble, pretty much. I mean, you just pop. It's really bad. So I'm just going to keep zoning him off of this farm here. Let's try and garner a lead. Oh, that was a mistake, buddy. If I didn't get creep blocked, it would be... I'm gonna... Do you see how fast we autoed that bleed onto him? I should have W'd that. See, he's level 2 and now I'm level 4, right? Just because of that zone off. He will hit level 3 off of this wave. But it will significantly affect his total laning phase. I'm going to stand in the minions so if he tries to queue me, he has to queue the minions. Now it's going to shove into me. Or maybe it's not. Ooh. Why is it staying? But yeah, so since the only reason I'm staying up here is because Wukong's here. So uh, since I'm being strong-sided, I don't really have to worry about a gank. Because Wukong can just gank me. Again, I'm going to sit behind his minions. He has to queue his minions if he wants to hit me. And he throws two of his farm there. He got the one, but that's fine. And now the wave shoves into me. We're going to abuse that. Hopefully. I would trade him here, but the wave is just so large. that I don't think that's smart. But that one? I was hoping to get a first blood this game, but eh, it doesn't always happen. Because it, it's just, it's so good for my lead. I'm going to dodge that. Trade him here. I nicked him with it. Get his bone plating with the bleed. He's up a level on me now, that's fine. Uh oh, I'm going to miss that cannon, aren't I? I should have stepped up for the cannon. That was actually really dumb of me. He's leaving, he might TP back. Try and see if he can get an item lead on me. But the funny thing is, I'll still win that fight. Without Ignite, he unironically has no kill pressure on me. So... Oh, shoot. Damn, I actually really threw that. I can get that one, though. Uh, We can hold the wave here. Did he TP back? He did. I will still win that fight. Little does he know. And of now, I'm 6. So I'm up 15 CS on him, which is about a solo kill. So I have a lot of gold. But the problem is I don't have that gold spent. So I either need... I want to I see if I can zone him here again. I miss a farm for it. Oh, I miss 2 because I suck. I miss 3 because I suck. 
I missed four. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. That is not good at all. That is that is very bad, actually. I actually don't know whether... Oh my gosh, dude. I never learned how to play League of Legends. I, I actually think that... I Oh, yeah. Trade him there. He's going to try and cue me. Yeah, I'm going to leave. So the usual start for this build is Essence Reaver. So I'm going to go Sheen first. Sheen's a pretty good item on Darius. And I'll grab another potion. Why not? I don't really care about getting a control ward. I'm not really worried about it. He's going to do drag. Yeah, he's already 2-0-1. I wasn't even paying attention to that. Yeah, He is... Pretty fed here. Yeah, it's been a pretty slow game to start, but it's okay. I might roam. That really is looking juicy. The other good thing about having Hail of Blades is because my bleed stacks come up so fast from my auto attack speed, I am able to get my uh, aura faster, like the full damage. And my sheen makes my W do really good damage. While I don't gain any auto attack damage from it, it will help my Hail of Blades trades because of my W. I actually want to get this wave a little bit so I can trade with him. I want to like auto it a bit. Weave it. And get our cannon. He's level 7, so we're on an even plane here. He wasn't able to back, so now I have more gold spent than him. So I am stronger than him. So he's playing very passive, which is really uncommon out of a Yasuo player. I actually expected him to like halfway run it down, which is what I would have rathered because I would definitely be winning right now. I can run it down way better than anybody else. You just trust me on that. None of y'all have seen me in action. Trust me. If you come to my streams and you see me in action, I run it down like no other. I am the best at running it down. Oh, he hit me with that. I'm actually gonna... Okay. Oh, almost took a turret shot there. Hee 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 hee. the guy there. I am gonna pop a potion here. I'm just gonna sit here. Probably think I'm gone. Step up for a minion. Mm, he's not falling for it, man. He's probably kiting me into his jungler. Actually, I can kill him here now. That. Perfect. I didn't want to ult him right there because of his shield. But, you know, a kill's a kill, right? Who really cares? I did have to pop Ghost for it. Uh, I'm not going to go for that plate. I'm going to go ahead and back. I probably should. Although that's not good. Oh, well, that's good. Am I about to say that's not good again? I'm going to sell my potion so I can get little boots. Movement speed determines fights. And he's going to have Berserker's Grieve, so I need to have at least something to counteract that. Plus, I have no ghost. Yep, this is good. This is good. This is very good. And he's going to get grubs. Man, our jungler is going for it, man. Two grubs. Oh, he didn't finish the drag. They're going for a dive here. What a dive. Never seen anything like it. That might be the best dive I've ever seen. So now that I've killed him, he's definitely not stepping up, and he already wasn't. So this is really lame. But I have some AD now, and he's just got some on hit. And of course, Yasuo is very good with on hit, but... We're just gonna keep on farming. I don't want him to Q that minion. I want him to drop his Q stacks, which he already has at this point, so that's good. See, he's just not going to get to play the game. And if he steps up to try and play the game, I'm going to kill him for playing the game. 
Welcome to playing Yasuo Top. What an experience. I, do not tolerate cowardice. I would never play Yasuo Top just because it's so easily abusable by most bruisers. But you're you're gonna see the one shotting capabilities once I scale. Yasuo's gone. I just gotta get to the point where I have items to do so. A lot of people rush collector. I like Essence Reaver because Darius already has mana problems. And Essence Reaver partly removes that if you're farming halfway decent. Which I am not, but still. You know, missing one farm goes a long way when you do it 60 times. Yeah, like right there. Eh, you better get off these minions, buddy. Mm, you're not farming, buddy. Dude, what a wind wall. I've never seen anything like it. I can't wait for the next one. Please cue me. Please, hit it. <laughs> he tried. We can dive him. Oh, now we can't. My bleed's drop stacked. My bleed stacks dropped. Wow. Don't know how to speak. Never spoken English today in my life. With overwhelming force. Oh. That didn't hit. Alright. Oh, okay. Yasuo moment, am I right, guys? Uh, that's what happens when you play against that champion. Love it. Yeah, I mean, Yasuo does Yasuo things. You touch the ground, and he can still press R and hold you in the air for another six seconds. It's kind of funny. I mean, both him and Yone are broken, so it figures. But their win rate isn't good, says Riot. It's not inflated at all, says Riot. Trust me, bro, says Riot. <laughs> Love Riot. We love you, don't worry. It's all a joke at the end. He has to back into his tower. He won't be... Yeah, yeah, there you are. Oh, no, you're dead. Oh, he's so lucky. I'm out for blood now. You have to stay, or half your turret disappears, bud. Well... His turret's gone. Oh, right, he has TP. That's summoner spell. He's gonna eat through these minions and try and... Oh, that didn't hit! That's crazy. I'm actually mind blown. My mind is indeed blown. Cool, that hit. Thank you. Well, now I have full item. And he's going... What is he going first? Bork? What a weirdo. Who goes Bert Bork first on Yasuo? Uh, oh, my bleed got it. There's no chance, man. This guy's so passive for a Yasuo, man. Your character is so offensively tailored. Go in, man. Please? Just don't hit me with an airborne. Ball. Please cue that minion. I would love it if you were to t attempt to cue that minion. The fact that I almost died there is kind of insane. Only Yasubo things. Yeah, we just gotta get some more crit and we're good to go. This mid laner is slaying. It's actually insane. And jungler's dead, so I don't gotta worry about anything unless Aurelia comes up. 
which I would doubt at this point. But like one thing is Darius is like never full mana. And the fact that I'm full mana right now speaks for itself. So I do like this build a lot. Sometimes it messes up my farm like right there. But that's the only issue I've ever had with the build. As much as I would go Berserkers just to be hilarious, I am going to go Steel Caps. Just simply because of their team. And then we're going to go over to the Marksman page, which is such a weird place for me to be. And we're going to start on a Collector. Because then this means my Bleed can execute. And that is super huge. We want the Bleed to be able to execute because imagine... You've just got autoed four times by a Darius and you're a squishy target and all of a sudden you just disappear and you're just like, oh, okay, I was at 5% HP, but go off, King. Like, that's kind of the experience. This Wukong is fed as well. He should be going for Aurelia here, but now he's dead. And Yasuo's there. I mean, I did ping him, so... If they die, it's not really my fault. Oh, they don't even die. That's kind of hilarious. He also has nothing to Q to. So I just get... Three here. Yeah, you see, that's 715. You can't tell me that's not insane. Like, you can literally one-shot with your W. I have a feeling Aurelia and Yasuo are coming here, so I'm going to rotate over to mid and collect this wave here. Because that is much smarter than me doing that. Okay, so Aurelia roamed bot. So that's fine, right? So I can go collect this mid wave and then I can go back top. Right? And then Yasuo's gone. So we're going to ping that. Right? Yasuo's here. So I'm going to go here. Put a ward down here for my Mr. Wukong. I don't know what Karma's doing. Is she's putting down a deep ward? The reasoning unknown. Now all I can do is pray I get crits. It's partly lethality, Darius, because of the collector. But yeah, my like my crit chance right now is only 20%. So when I do crit, it's it's a lot, but it's rare. But yeah, my W crit is is literally insane. And I just never run out of mana. So it's a pretty funny item, all in all. But yeah, the goal is just to outplay Yasuo. But he's gone again. So is Aurelia. She's dead. Zareth's dead. They're going to get mid turret. I don't know where Yasuo is. I'm actually curious. Where is he? Oh, here he is. Okay, he's going to try and Q me here. I'll just go take his jungler's camps if he's going to be here. And if he tries to contest me on it, I'll just kill him. He has no ignite. It's not like he can kill me on it. Too late, bud. Stay alert. Oh, almost, man. We're gonna go mid here. I see a play. Poppy's here. That means Aurelia's gonna rotate. I can't 2v1 right now. I'm not that strong. Okay, Poppy's still here. She's going bot side now, so I can roam safely. Control ward there, so we know there's no vision. Ghosting. Perfect. And my collector's done, but I gotta go top first to defend, because Yasuo's there. He's gonna try and take my turret. He might actually get it. Nah, he won't get it. Since he's not going to get the turret, I'm going to go around the backside. Right here. Oh, Yasuo's going that way. Where's he going? Okay, he is backing up this way. Waiting for Wukong so he can get some KP. Okay. 
and I don't lose my turret. So they don't get objective bounty. I get two kills. How worth is it? Very. So you have two options. You can go Navori's or you can go Infinity Edge. Infinity Edge does more damage. So I'm going Infinity Edge. Navori's on paper seems so much better. But the issue is I always have to be autoing somebody and it's just not always going to be happening. And I don't really like it. I'd rather have the extra crit damage and blow them up because this is more meant for sustain in a way. Like it's meant for sustain, right? And... Like, see that, dude? That I literally just one-shot her. Oh, I tried to flash it. Oh, th he doesn't die. He didn't have bleed stacks on him. I tried. That was really stupid of me. I missed my Q because of his stupid E. He does get the turret there, so that's not worth at all. Although they're just running it down mid, like they're winning too. It's actually hilarious, I'm not even gonna lie. Someone needs to defend here though, like this is actually crazy. No one has TP up. Oh yeah, we just lose that turret. Okay, that's fine. We're gonna lose this one too, like we... Erm... Bend. <laughs> what fellas? It's sad that I die there, but, you know, what can I do about an Unleashed TP? Nothing, sadly. I do have Ghost up soon. If I had Ghost up there, I would have killed both of them with literal ease. It wouldn't have been a fight. But, nah, I died. Also, if I had any armor, too. That's the, that's the thing I was just talking about earlier. Like, if I had armor stats, I would have easily killed both of them there. Like, I just didn't have any armor or anything. Like, a death stance would have saved me. But yeah, these these crits are insane. Like I still I have fifty five percent crit chance already with just these two items, uh, or well three technically because of the crit cloak. Oh shoot! Uh, actually, we don't need to go mid. They can get Nash there. Actually, I don't know what to do here. Actually, I'm gonna go here though. We should kill them here. Not Nautilus, Nautilus, my boy. Nautilus, my friend. Nautilus, my homie. Oh, they're gonna kill them before I even get here. There's no point in me even being here. Yo, that was some crazy damage right there, dude. We just aced them. Oh, we almost did. I wouldn't be surprised if they FF'd. Not from this raid, at least. But that damage was insane. Did you see that W damage? It's actually crazy. Yeah, 922? Like, come on, man. Let's be serious here. Like, that is not okay. But yeah, this build is interesting. It's better mid than it is top. I just don't like playing it mid. Because I'm not good enough to play against casters as a melee. I'm just not. And I'm willing to admit that. The only thing this build could benefit from is some, like, extra attack speed. And sometimes I'll build a Kraken. But it's very rare. I'd rather build something else. I feel like they're all coming down for me, so I'm gonna run away. And we just got Baron. That's pretty huge. If they're coming down, they're coming through river, so I might be able to like meet him here. Might be on drag. Maybe. Noxus will rise. Let's get this ward. Might as well. We can do this. Yeah, did you see that man? I'm critting almost every time, too, oddly enough. I'm not supposed to be. I don't know what Aurelia plans on doing there. I need Q heal, man. Oh, come on. <sighs> the stupid smolder execute. I played that so bad. I just walked into a stun and let it happen. Dude, the Smolder Execute is insane, by the way. This guy's 10 and 13. Can we talk about that? 
Kind of crazy, man. Kind of crazy. We might need a shield bow just for the survivability part. We need something to keep us alive. Bloodthirster wouldn't be too bad. We could do that. It can give you some attack speed too, right? It has attack speed? No, it doesn't. Yeah, this would be fine. I think we I think we can do this. I think we can do this. I'm just playing poorly. Yeah, we got this. Here, let me get a let's get a blue trinket. I'm farming pretty bad too. I've just been bad this game. Let's not run it down mid with everybody else. Let's do something else. Like Karma, right? She is doing something else. Poppy was there, so I don't really feel a need to check her camps. Although I could plop a ward down in one of these bushes just to be a real quick. Okay. Oh no, there's two of them. I will not rest. Right, I have no ghost, so my outplay potential is low. Need some help here. There's gonna be two here. I could borrow some assistance. Because if Yas pops his head out, right? Because they're not doing anything mid. They're not out pushing us. Cool. So now when I crit, it's going to do so much more damage. Alright, it's cool. I saw her on that. So let's go down here and kill her because she's alone. I'll just take it. She's going to run. We have mid open, so I'm going to head down here and help them out. We just need to watch out for a Yas alt. Nautilus, you need to hook somebody, man. This is actually a really stupid play, having all of us stay here. This is such a, like, an iron thing to do. I mean, given this is iron, so... Good. Be fair. You know what? I'm staying. We're gonna, we're gonna run it down in one lane, because we're iron. Cool, I got one. I keep alting too early by mistake. Youch. No, there's no chance we go in here. That is exactly why. Ah, I was a Xerath player. I know what you're doing. I have 30k mastery on that character. Oh, shoot. I'm trying to leave, man. Can you leave me alone? Bro, you actually make me want to cry. Oh, hold on. Let me go help him. Oh my gosh, he's better. What? We just end off that, no? Oh wait, no, they're coming back up. I do need some lifesteal, so that'll be nice once I have it. This lifesteal will really help me help keep me alive. I would like the crit cloak on a serious note, but eh. We can do without it. I might sell my Doran's Blade just for the... Oh, no, I can't afford it yet, right? Because it sells for, what, 160? 180? Yeah. Yeah, Draven. I was about to say, Draven's about to cash out, man. Holy. I didn't even notice that. What the hell? This guy's fed fed. I thought I was doing well. That guy is fed. Yeah, I know. I'm already going up there. Not Naughty Waddy. Don't you worry, buddy. Strength above all. <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, so we got the Drake. I'm on the split. They're like all there. So, free base. Holy man. Never retreat. 
And they're just wiping the entire team. Oh, shoot. I'm actually in danger here. I took heavy artillery from them. Yeah, nah. I'm gonna go back over now. I'll just split back over here. Nothing wrong with that. They should be FFing, honestly. I guess they're getting gate kept or something. That's gotta be the case. You see how much tower damage I do, buddy? <laughs> Did you see that crit? That's insane. Oh my gosh, that was one W. Holy. Oh, I didn't even get an assist for that. Dude, Draven popped off, bro. GG, man. What a game. What a game, man. What a game. Let's see. I definitely didn't do the most damage. I know that. But it was a good game, nonetheless. Good job, Draven. I don't know who the hell he was, but... Insane. Yeah, bro. I did good damage, too. And we had a couple of really high damage Ws in there and played some fairly okay gameplay. I feel like it wasn't great, but it was good. So, for all of you all watching out there, I appreciate you joining. I appreciate you all so, so very much. And I hope you all have a spectacular day with the rest of your day. You all have a good one. See you all later. Goodbye.